the work I do is, um, is a combination of economics, uh, information security, and psychology. We did find uh, surprising results uh, when we started applying economics and um, behavioral psychology to understanding, in particular, privacy decision making. When you provide assurances um, about um, their privacy being protected to individuals, individuals become actually uh, less willing uh, to provide personal information, which is a counterintuitive result. And the reason we believe uh, is the cause for this uh, phenomenon is that people become uh, uh, primed to think about privacy, because uh, when we don't realize the information we are revealing, and this information, this trace of data are pretty much continuous, in a way we are almost not equipped to act in an efficient, optimal way and, and, and decide what should we protect and, show, and what should, uh, we should reveal. So, hence the importance of the kind of research we, we try to do, combine economics and psychology, to really understand what people know, why they act the way they do, and whether we can uh, try to uh, find uh, solutions, which could be technological solutions or policy solutions, legislation, and so on and so forth, or liability or incentives, other, um, to, in order to direct, try to direct the market towards a, a more efficient outcome.